Hi guys, it's Jordan from and Jordan. And today we're gonna do a try on haul from Shein. Is it too good to be true or is it not too good to be true? We're gonna find out. This is not very environmentally friendly yeah. because of how much plastic they do use. They do use a lot of plastic. But and it's nice and uh, folded and it is. sealed. And it is very easy to see what everything is because it's all individual. Yeah. But if you're looking for a waste-free place, this is yeah. not for you. This is our first thing. It's just this adult onesie. <laughs> and on my first impression, it seems a little bit thin. I was thinking the same thing, but I am somewhat impressed that it does have a texture. It's not completely smooth like I thought it was going to be. Yeah, it, it just does. has a little bit of a texture. You can like feel there's yeah. little stuff. Just for size reference, I got a small and she got an extra small. I don't know how They don't even they really look. look that different, honestly. They yeah. probably aren't even different. So we're just gonna go ahead and try it out. Yeah. The length is quite long. I don't think it's bad. I don't think it's bad either. It's definitely wearable. I feel like, um, I feel like mine just could be cute. A tad baggy on the back. Just a tad. Mine has a little bit of bag in the back also. But I think it's super cute. Yeah, it's pretty cute. And we can twin. Oh yeah, you can definitely see the panty line, but if you're wearing it with jean shorts, it should be okay. It should be fine. And if, if people see it, who cares? Cause they probably know that this is a body thing anyways. Also, I would say the neck part is a little bit uncomfortable, but it doesn't feel choky. It's, but it's just, just there. But it's just a turtleneck-ish. Like, it's yeah. as, com as uncomfortable as a turtleneck would be. So, it, yeah. It's just, like, there. It's not like it's squeezing or anything. Yeah. One, two, three. Seven. seven. <laughs> I was going to say eight, but then I heard you starting to say seven, so I thought seven. But I'd give it an eight just because of the baggy back and... Yeah. Long crotch. My drawback <laughs> line. Are those are the exact drawbacks I took off one point for each one. Except for the choky neck a little because I mean that's to be expected. But yeah. it's not it's a little thin, but it's definitely not see through. Thin. Yeah, I'm oh, wearing a actually, black bra. Can you see my black bra? I think the black bra just a little bit blends in because this it's black right here. So you can wear black or white or whatever and it won't really show. Just don't wear like hot pink under it. Yeah. But and black and white or is nude. fine. Yeah, or nude. And I, I'm impressed. For size reference, I'm 5'5". Five, five. Jordan is like 5'4 or something. Yeah. But Okay, so we got pretty much the same style, except they're just slightly oh, different. Oh, mine is not what I thought it would be. It has way shorter sleeves. That looks pretty schmexy. Yeah, and it's for the beach, so... It's very wrinkled. Yours is really Ooh, I kind of like how the sleeves do that. I thought I was going to think it was weird, but I think it's Mine don't. <laughs> wow, we look really schmexy. And these are both pretty long. Like they, Yeah, they I think mine, like, yours probably is a little mine longer. Mine might be a tiny bit longer, but... And this one has flamingos on it. And mine just has flowers. Jardins has flowers. So depending on what your vibe is that you're going for, these are both really schmexy options. Oh, I think it's kind of cute on the sides as you can see it comes out a little so I'll probably just wear this with a bralette that you're meant to see Jordan is having some technical difficulties. I would say this is probably like a 6 out of 10 um, As you can see it's a v-neck in the back and there's little adjusty things here so you can adjust the height of the straps which is actually probably going to be pretty useful for me. I'll probably adjust it up a little bit. Um, and that might look a little better depending on what look you're going for. But if you want a super plunging neckline, you can leave it long. This is mine. Um, it looks a little wrong because of the bra I'm wearing. Um, I got a small again. It fits fine in the body. It is a little tight on my arms. But it's one of the snappy ones. It only has two snaps. And it's definitely harder to snap than the previous one. It does not have as loose of a back. It has a tiny bit of loose back, but it fits really well. I think it's pretty schmexy. Oh, it smells really kind of gross. <laughs> it smells like chemicals. And it does have a very itchy tag right here. Not see-through because it's black. I would give it a six out of 10 S's because it's tight on my arms, but that could just be my own fault for not ordering the correct size, but it fits everywhere else. But yeah, six out of 10. So this is my next top. Um, 
I'm not really sure how I feel about it. I think it looks kind of weird because of the bra I'm wearing and I because I'm like wearing these pants. It looks like something that is from like not now. Somewhere between the 70s and the 90s. <laughs> well, I don't know. It looks like something your mom would give you kind of. Well, but it's still pretty cute. I think if I wear a different bra with it, then I think it will look okay. The color is kind of strange. It's like a mixture between forest green and gray. Um, but personally, I think that the color is fine. But if you don't like really drab colors, you probably won't like this color. Oh yeah, socks. this is exciting. I'm excited. I got some unicorn socks. Once again, nice, wasteful plastic. This is like thick plastic too. It's extra wasteful. Oh, they Whoa, didn't seal mine so all the way. Just, wow, mine was sealed all the way, so that shows a uh, <laughs> manufacturing this error. This looks like something from Adventure Time. <laughs> I got a giraffe. I got these unicorns. As you can see, they're really cute. Yeah, mine has hair. This isn't even a unicorn. <laughs> Don't be fooled just because they had one of the freaking horns. You can cut off one of the horns. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like a skater boy. The heel part is not very pronounced, so if you have a really pronounced heel, this, this might be a little you bit You can see the little odd. hair things right here where it's attached. But yeah, I'm excited anyway, even though I'm slightly disappointed that these aren't unicorns. I should just cute. give them some names. Um, this one's going to be Gerald, and this one's Marvin. This one's going to be Atticus. <laughs> and this one's going to be Kyle. These are our socks. Or should one of them be a girl? That's, That's it, it for our haul. haul. I would definitely order from Shein again. I would also, and I have also ordered from them in the past. <laughs> I mean, you kind of get what you pay for when it comes to, like, shirts. But they I are pretty thin, but good stuff for the price like this i don't even think is that thin it's just like a little thin but like but i feel like, like you would supposed you to could be. buy like kind of the same quality stuff but like forever 21 in the yeah cheap, cheap section or um i would definitely say go for it with the kimonos yeah because it doesn't matter if it's thin it's supposed to be thin <laughs> so they are definitely a good idea i would just be wary about ordering white things since things are so thin thanks for watching like, comment, and subscribe. subscribe. Bye! <laughs>